the fluttering fruit bats are a delight to watch however we couldn't really get that a clear view of their face here we do hope that we'll see some more bats and we'll get that a clear view of its face we are back to the pelican nests accompanying them this time are some more fruit bats the fruit bats were totally unexpected and they were hanging upside down like like typical bats this is a black headed ibis this which flew away quite soon and here if you observe closely all the open bill stalks here are sitting in couples bahar the painted stalks like to sit in solitude this one is sitting atop a tree like it's the king of the world and you can see some more birds soaring past asked the pelicans again like to sit together and it's a very nice sight it is almost as if they're gurgling in, with their in, inside that mouth and that pouch that pouch in itself is huge but when a pelican yawns is when you can see the ridiculous size of its beak the bats underneath are just fluttering around and while the pelicans go about their business happy safe and sound we are right underneath the nests of the pelicans now Oh, and it's one of the most beautiful sights that you that I think you could ever get to see. As we are about to finish our boat ride, a greater cormoran comes and greets us. We were seeing little cormorans all throughout this journey. Our first greater cormoran has appeared <clears throat> here it might not be visible and as we are heading to the exit we find a cattle egret going about its day because it's against the sun it's difficult to see but when it moves you can see it so hope you enjoyed this uh, second visit to rangana situ bird sanctuary it was very uh, good um it it was fantastic so we hope to meet you in another episode until then bye